One man posed the question, how long could he last on 100 bucks in New York City? And in this moment where so many Americans are looking for ways to save amid rising costs, high inflation, his TikTok quest is going viral now. Hundreds of thousands of viewers watching his posts every single day to see how far he can make a hundo stretch. Take a listen. Day 30 on seeing how long $100 can last me in New York City. We started off today at 4.33, so I made my own coffee and I ate the last of my nuts for breakfast. Kind of delicious. The nuts gave me enough energy to walk to the gym, but only enough to shower and brush my pearly browns. It is a tight budget in the Big Apple. And, you know, at first he just wanted to see if he could make 100 bucks last a week. But he went the seven days and he only spent 34 bucks. 34 bucks that week. So now he is seeing how long he can make it stretch. And I do want to welcome in Frankie. Oi now, thank you so much for being here. Hi, Natasha, how are you? <laughs> I am doing well. And, and first I have to ask, what day are we on now? How much is left? We're on day 31. I have $1.58 left. Oh my goodness. How much longer do you think you can make that stretch? You know, I, I think today might, might be the last day, Natasha. I think it might be the last day. How does it feel? It feels good. I didn't think I would make it this long, 31 days, but I feel good. It's very impressive, and we know you're living that van life, so, you know, living in a van yeah. definitely helps with expenses like rent. Um, you definitely make your own instant coffee instead of Starbucks as well. What other tips can the average person take away for how you made it stretch this long? Uh, live in a van. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Step one. Just move into your car, yeah. No, also, um, I, drink, I bring my own water everywhere I go, too. Yes, so you don't have to buy those beverages. I know there's been a lot of ramen, uh, picking up gigs as a caterer, taking home uh, leftovers as well and things that are, are not yeah. eaten. And you also found a way to pick up extra food from restaurants at the end of the night for about five bucks. Tell us about that. That's interesting. Yeah, it's an app called Too Good To Go, which I really messed up because they're not paying me, they're not sponsoring me. But it's <laughs> yeah, a <good> Frankie, <laughs> you gotta make that money. Yeah. Well, now you can see how I find myself in this financial situation. <laughs> Too good to go. Yeah, I, I literally downloaded it because I saw it on your TikTok. It's this app where you yeah. can get the food from the restaurant at the end of the day that they're not going to sell. Very, very smart. Tell us about the virality for a moment because people are recognizing you now. How does it feel that hundreds of thousands of people are tracking your journey every single day? Hey, it feels good. You know, I feel like people are starting to save money more, but I got recognized in my bathroom, aka the, the gym locker room. <laughs> that, that one was a little weird. <laughs> what are these interactions like? People just saying, like, you're that guy and wanting to take a photo with you. Yeah, yeah, or like uh, doing stand up because I'm a comedian. I just did a show right now and as I got on stage, somebody was like, for free? So I was like, all right. <laughs> it's all these little catchphrases. I have to say, when I sit down to dinner with my partner, I'm, we're like, delicious. <laughs> you did not hop <laughs> the turd style. Frankie, Oy, it's, it's, it's such a joy, it's such a pleasure. What is next for you once this money runs out? What's next? You know, I, I really enjoy the vlog aspect of it. So I don't know, un, until I figure out a different theme, I'm just going to keep vlogging because I'm really enjoying it. Frankie, wishing you the best of luck. And I know that, you know, the hustle is real, being out there trying to make it as a comedian in New York City. And, you know, you found fame a whole other way. And I hope people will be turned on to your comedy as well. Frankie Oi, all the best. Thank you. Thank you, Natasha. All right. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.